Hi there, welcome to A-Value. I am a manager at the hang of the computing system at A-Value. I've been working in the IT industry for over two decades, which including 10 years at A-Value. The rest was the notebook, DAS, NAS, memory, and SSD for 12 years. It's time to tell you why you should absolutely take A-Value computing system. You excited, I excited, let's do this. You might run into these situations. Spend a lot of resources with the customer to do the field testing, to apply for some specific certification for a project, and finally it's approved. However, the supplier told you the product was end of life or will be end of life soon. It's a disaster. The computing system passed the field test and got a green light eventually. You and your customer were very happy and plenty of deploying it to a factory to inside equipment. However, a couple of months or a year later, the customer complains and the quality issue came up one by one. And since endless, it's a nightmare. The unbridled project demand comes from different usages. The project size could be small, medium to a very big one. You didn't want to let it go, but there was no capable partner who could hang in a proposal. To deliver the prototype quickly, it's a pity. I'm going to emphasize what AVALU has done on longevity, customization, and trustworthiness. Longevity is easier said than done. Every PC maker said they could do it, even a consumer PC maker too. I'm not going to say they lied to you, but I'd like to show you the stronger evidence for air value. The Intel D5 25 processor launched in 2010. It's the end of life in 2015. The AMD LS800 processor launched in 2005. It's incredible. The 9 and 11 years, if you have a kid, a baby could be a happy student at the elementary school. The 16 years, a baby could be a joyful teenager. The important thing is, Avery still supplied the product at the customer request in 2021. Avery tries to extend the product life as long as we can. It's amazing, right? Avery can do plenty of customization service from the very tiny things, the package change, such as changing material, color, having your logo and model name on it, the bias and firmware modification, such as having your logo during boot up, all specific different settings, to fight you the V-bias to the panel, to develop an API at the usage model. The OS image preloading on the production line, including Windows, Linux, even Android. The color of the painting change on chassis, such as being white in hospital, changing the silk screen at the customer CIS. The PCBA can do single or double side conformal coding for moisture proof. The mechanical modification to fit the equipment or machine to add LCN display with programmable information, etc. The sales revenue for the computing system is roughly 60% of the standard, 40% of the ODN. The customer come from everywhere requested certification are covering general to the medical, the vehicle, the railway, the maritime. That's all the evidence to show our capability and how qualified everyone is, especially the medical certification. It's extremely hard. Every does a lot of audience for the well-known companies spreading over Europe, Japan, and America. The maritime in Russia and America. The vehicle in Europe and Southeast Asia. When talking about embedded and fanless, how to qualify the design is so important. 
A PC maker can go either tough or easy way to prove it. Everyone takes the TAT, an Intel official tool, to hit the processor following the Intel design white paper. Besides, every test team put the thermocouple on the key component to make sure it's on the chipset spec. The airflow is an element that's easy to be overlooked. The average criteria is no airflow. The sales once complained about the spec because of the same size and platform, but the other IPC's operating temperature is better. So, Avery studied and debunked the test condition allow the airflow. Also, assess the low and best frequency swattering. Come on, not all the embedded use condition has the airflow. And you pay the money, but not get the performance you expected. The impact on the high temperature is the reliability. In the long run, the problems are going to be pop up like bombs. I have some customers who took the incredible ultra low cost computing system. In the end, they went back to A value since they got a very bad experience. It's quite consume time, money, and pay for your reputation. The computing system is divided into four categories, including the comeback, the modular, the expandable, and vertical market series. I'd like to emphasize my team is only good as a standard product, but also very familiar with the customization service both the OEN and ODN. The same product and experience can be leveraged to speed up everything to support the customer to win pressure to earn more money. Okay, let's go into a bit of detail for each series. The compact series offer a high CP value, multiple mounting options, the wide coverage, this series gets a very good balance in between the quality and pricing with a high quality design and tough test criterion to deal with the thermal. And most of them are truly totally met. Let's tend to offer the customer the high CP value computing system. In limited space, you don't only need the size as small as possible, but also the various mounting options to put the computing system on the back of a display as the digital synergy, to put it on a wall in a cabinet as a control unit, to put it on a track to be sliding as a movable communication unit, to put it on a table as a digital conference. The sizes are very small, covered from the pound size, A5 size, and a little big one with the better performance. The CPU covered from the low TTP 6 watt to 45 watt in the entry Anton and the client USH Core I. This tend to fulfill the customer demand as the true one-step service. Next up, the thoughtful modular series. A central unit at the left hand side. This can install different I/O expansion modules at the right hand side that we call the IET modules to fit the unbride IPC demands easily. IET is an acronym, stands for Every Unique Intelligence Expansion Technology. Currently, we've got over 10 IT modules for different usages. For instance, if the customer need more LAN posts with the PSE and GPIO isolated for machine vision in the factory, they can take the AUS N08. If the customer just need more isolated compost for the gate control, they can take the AUS N03. If none of the IT modules meet the project demand, everyone can design a new one in a very short period to deliver the prototype. The best record is six weeks. The expandable series was born for the customer to install different add-on car per the field application locally. Of course, everyone can do it for you, 
due to Taiwan is the IT base. There are so many industrial Adam car makers nearby. We can search for an appropriate car and install it during production. That's quite save time and money for the customer. The industry usage cases are too many to cover. Most of the time, it comes in small quantity that's hard to go modification on existing computing system to take a project. Every offers a series of expandable computing systems in different types, covering the fan layers, desktop, tower, 1U, 2U, 4U, rack mounts, with a budgetary to the extreme performance option. From the entry end to the current Leon, from the low TDP to over a 100 watt processor. Transportation is one of our main focuses for the vertical market. Every has a stronger foundation. The next is spreading the world. That relies on the customer and every to work together. Every PM will be highly involved to help the customer to win project. Essentially, this kind of project always comes in a better margin but needing to dig, like take time. However, it's a way to jump out of the price competition. You reap what you sow. Mirror type 2, everyone has the standard computing system with a few projects from Russia and America. Let's step together to grab more projects in the tough 2021 to do something different. It's a real case to reflect the modular benefit. The main ring system built on every modular series and I am sure the computing system in maritime will be developed continuously. Don't be surprised if you see the all-in-one panel PC in 2022 for the maritime. The rest cover the AI and automation. Everyone has the standard computing system for Smart FA in China. It can connect four channel cameras and take the isolated GPIO to control actions in an optimized response time, under one millisecond. Again, it's another to show the modular benefit. The machine vision system built on every modular series too. Every computing system got the certifications on the Edge Software Hub from Intel and the Azure certified device from the Microsoft. The numbers is still increasing now. These certifications aim to help the partners in which ecosystem struggle with product selection and field testing. That will be helpful to shorten the schedule to support the partners to boost AI and IoT market quickly and conveniently. If you ask me, the every computing system which on list here, whether they can pass both Intel and Microsoft certifications, the answer is definitely yes. No worries, just pick what you want. My team is gonna do more case studies and add down value software in other sections. If you want even more every computing system, Make sure you come back next time. And of course, you know what to do, but I'm gonna say it anyway. Don't believe what I said. Try it, and I can almost guarantee you, you will be surprised at the A value. Thank you for watching. My name is Joe. This has been A value e channel. I'm out.